Apparently, a bird decided to join us. <coughs> Perfect way to start the episode. Hey guys, welcome back to Pajama Sam 4. I hopefully we finish in this episode, but I'm gonna have one Thursday left. I didn't realize that, that there was four Thursdays in July. Apparently there's five. Yay! Um, wait, what was I doing again? Okay, I have a sweater, I have socks. Oh yeah, I have to go this way to get the mold, to get the sponge to eat the mold. Maybe I can fill up my time by letting it play through all the animations. <laughs> Ooh, sniffles. Okay, so where's the sponge? Sponge, you make it eat the mold. Oh boy, oh boy. I smell mold. mold, 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 mold. Dude, dude, mold? calm down. There, there's mold in that shoehorn. Dude, dude, this sponge is insane. Look at that booty. Wow, did you eat all that mold? All of it. Mold all gone. Mold all gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't believe I ate the whole thing. I think I better go lie down now. And you're just gonna go back to the fish tank all on your own. I'm glad the sponge liked the taste of mold, because I sure don't. Well, yeah, it's a mold. So now, you play the foghorn thing. Reflection. I guess it's clean enough now. So, blow into it. And then it'll scare the shoes. Oh, wait, do I just grab one? Do I just grab one? Grab, grab a pair, come on. Rats. I'm not quite tall enough. Oh, they're like flying around. Oh, I get it. You would use the, there we go. Now, now we got it. We got I'm it. I'm glad this net has a long handle. <laughs> He's just like, okay, okay. I think I'll keep them. I don't I'll think they like you. Okay. So now we can go to the Grubby Corners Mall. Which is back this way. And I didn't even hit enter, it just did that. Go all the way back here. These signs are really confusing. Um Grubby Corners. Let me in. Not so fast. Hold it right there, Buster. Yes. I wanna see your shirt. Hello! And shoes. So you don't even have to be wearing them? Socks too. You just have to have them? Officer? Howdy, officer. Hmm. Howdy. Shoe socks. Well, kid, it looks like you're in total compliance with our dress code. You're a good citizen. Enjoy your shopping experience. Although, I guess they all do have eyes and mouths and stuff, so maybe it's best that we don't wear them. That might be weird. That could turn us into, into some weird Rule 34 stuff. Are we there yet? We're here! Inside the Grubby Corners Mall! Hooray! It's shopping time. I can shop for a lint brush. Thanks ha. for the lift, Sam. We're off to shop. See you later. Bye. Okay. Um, oh, 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 there's a card. Ooh, a pajama man trading card. That's probably going to be the last one I'm going to see, though. That's the problem. Lightning. Hmm. Hold on. Let me make sure. Ah! Okay, that was... Okay. Um, is there a guide for all the trading cards? Um. Nope, they don't have one. Um. Cards. Uh, no. 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 Okay. Um. Oh, I can go over here. What's in here? Leavens and squeezins. Is there a card? There's a card. I got all the cards. I got all the cards. Yes. 
If it'll, thank you. No, I didn't get all the cards, what the heck? There's still one more. I don't know where it is. Um. Welcome to Leavings and Squeezings, the fabulous house of pizza. Do you want to see a menu? No, thanks. I'm just browsing. Okay. So then let's go this way, I guess. Oh, there it is! Please be the last one! This is the last card of Yay! Life. I've officially found them all! Yes! Oh, wow. Congratulations! You found all the Pajama Man trading cards! Oh, I can't print it. Darn. Oh, well. Don't touch. Don't touch what? They didn't tell me what not to let you touch, so I'm telling you not to touch anything. I'm the hall monitor, and I'm supposed to keep you in line. In line for what? All the kids want to meet some guy named Dr. Grime. They probably want to touch stuff with their grubby little hands, too. Who is this Dr. Grime, anyway? He's Pajama Man's arch enemy. Who's Pajama Man? Who's Pajama Man? Sheesh. Sorry, I don't have time for chit-chat right now. Are you going to get in line, or are you going to just stand there? Hmm. Well... Hang on, bub. You need a special prize winner pass if you want to skip waiting in line. Where can I get one? Try the local greasy spoon, kid. Greasy spoon? The chow house, the feed bag, the diner, the place where the food is. Oh! You mean I can get a special prize winner? Shut up. Sorry. I get it now. So I guess I have to somehow get a pass up here at the leavens and squeezins. I know you had to come up here for something. So... Is this where I can get a path to see Dr. Grime? Yeah, it is, but they only go to the special lucky prize winners. How do I win one? Oh, you'll know when it happens. How can I win a special prize winner pass? You need to be the lucky 30th customer. What oh. number am I? I don't know offhand, but yesterday I was customer number 8, 9, and 10. Okay, so I gotta wait. Gotta wait till it says. Wait, no, 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 no. I gotta. And then I am. Thirty. Yay! Congratulations, sir. You are our lucky thirtieth customer. Yay! What do I win? You win this fantastical special prize winner pass. Oh boy! Just what I wanted! It is a great honor to win this prize. It is printed on durable paper and is sure to bring you hours of fun for years to come. <coughs> Enjoy your special prize winner pass. It won't give me fun, but it'll get me to Dr. Grime and get me my comic book back. That's all I want. Okay, so then grab the prize winner pass, give it to the lady. Well, why didn't you say you had a special prize winner pass? Because I didn't have one before. You're a prize winner, so you can pass. Please Yay! You're special, and you are a prize winner, so you can get a pass. So you can pass. Huh? What? Where? Look, it's Dr. Grime. What? Jackie! <laughs> Will you dine my underwear? I'm not Dr. Grime! I'm Pajama Sam! Hey, keep that line straight. Dr. Grime! Dr. Grime! I What's happening? I'm not Dr. Grime! Hey, no touching! Dr. Grime! Yikes! What's happening here? Do any of you guys know what's happening? Get so dirty today. I'm Is that literally why they thought he was Dr. Grime? Dr. Grime? Maybe dirtier. No wonder the 
those kids thought I was him. I need to clean myself up. I can't get past those kids while I look like Dr. Crime. So do I have to go all the way? I don't want to handle my comic book while I'm all dirty. Or it'll get all dirty. I wonder if there's anything I can wash with here. Oh, I see it. It doesn't have a sink. It looks like the only way I can get some water is from that fire sprinkler up there. I bet if I could get that sprinkler to turn on, it would wash me right off. So I need something to catch on fire. Pajama Man number one from getting wet. Okay, so how do I set things on fire? That sprinkler would wash me clean, I'll bet. Hmm. If only I can find a way to turn it on. Can I use the rope? Oh wait, I don't have my rope anymore. Um. Couch, jump on the couch. Oh, okay. Who's there? I'm your friendly local humans and squeezins delivery person. Does Dr. Grime want anything? Not right now, thank you. Okay, I'll just leave this menu in case you change your mind. That sounded like someone was trying to do a puberty thing and it just didn't work. What is this? This isn't a very fancy menu. Cold I string beans. Order four different things. Frozen Cold eggs. Cold string beans? Frozen eggs? Iced bacon? Well, gold bacon's good. Or hot cocoa. Um... I need hot One cocoa. Humongous hot cocoa, please. Yeah. Who so I. Your favorite leavens and squeezins. Leavens and squeezins. Thank you. Enjoy your fine food with our compliments. You have excellent taste. Have a nice day, sir. Thank you for putting my hot chocolate in the bag. That works. This hot oh, yes. lives up to its name. It's really hot. Okay, so it's too hot to drink right now. So basically, we would take it and put it up to to the fire extinguisher or fire if sprinkler. I hot cocoa from here, it would make a real mess. I need to get closer. So I need to get on the couch. Get on the couch. No, what are you doing? Where's this guy? Where's this guy? Okay, now move the couch closer. I don't know what you're doing, Sam, and why you're not just jumping on the couch. Stop. Hey, um. where does that go? Oh, I. Oh, okay. That makes total sense. Under normal circumstances, I wouldn't be doing this. And I certainly wouldn't advise any of my friends to do this. I wouldn't advise your friends to break physics either. I hope this is hot enough. It, it really wouldn't be, but let's, let's just go with the fact that it would. Why didn't he just like run all the way back to the washing machine and jump in there? I'm clean. Me after I get out of the shower. Water is falling from the sky. It's raining! And voila! Dr. Grime? Who are you? I am the squeaky clean hero, Pajama Sing. Today, I came dangerously close to turning dirty. But from today on, I shall fight the forces of dirt. And strive for cleanliness in all that. So, because he was a little dirty, well, I learned one thing. From they thought he was a huge Doctor Grime monster. That doesn't make any sense. And if I do, it will sure be easier to find it. Look at this kid. Look at this straw kid. He's just like, ah. Yeah, that's an that guy. Pajama Man issue number one. Yes, indeed. It is the very rare Pajama Man issue number one. In mint condition in its plastic bag. Today, Where did he get a plastic bag? To get it autographed by Pajama Man himself and Oh my gosh! I and he's suddenly back home. I gotta hurry and meet him before he's gone. Mom, wait for me. 
What? That ending was anticlimactic. Like, what? What was that ending? Okay. That game was by far the worst. Pa oh, God, I just bumped my desk. Sorry. That was the worst Pajama Sam game. And I played the little games that came on, like, that came on discs that were, like, special games. They were, like, hold on, I can look them up. They were, like, games you, they were, like, print games, like, where you would just, like, play little mini games and get printouts and stuff. I'm trying to remember what they were called. I, and I really didn't like Sam's voice. I mean, it wasn't that bad, it could have been worse, but why couldn't they find a, a replacement for Pamela? That would have been awesome. Okay, so their games are, oh. Junior Arcade Puzzle Games, Pajama Sam Sockworks, and Lost and Found. And then there's One Stop Fun Shop and Games to Play on Any Day. One Stop Fun Shop was the printing one, and then... Um... Oh. So... I guess one of them was just like a mini game game, and then Lost and Found was like... Was kind of like this, but a mini game. And then like you would just catch all your lost stuff. So Sockworks is kind of like you're finding everything, all the socks, kind of like how you did in the first one. So the first Pajama Sam is honestly the best one, like all around. Second one's my favorite, but the first one's the best one all around. The fourth one's the worst one. The third one I just haven't played enough. I I, I guess I liked it, but I didn't play. I haven't played it enough to give an honest opinion. Um, yeah, the fourth one was just bad. That's just bad. I didn't like it that much. The cards were kind of irritating. Wow, that's not even going. Sorry. I didn't realize that if it if I didn't have the window selected, it didn't go forward. But yeah, that wasn't a Would that you like game. To restart the game. That game wasn't very good. I'm sorry I made you all watch four parts of that, and I'm sorry I had to record four parts of that. I hope you all somewhat enjoyed this game. This is probably the worst playthrough I've done yet because I don't really like this game. But I wanted to finish it because I knew it wouldn't be that bad. And I fi actually finished this game, which I am proud of doing because I didn't do it when I got it when I was like seven. So I accomplished something. <laughs> uh, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this series and I will see you guys in the next video. Keep calm and party conservatively.